yeah so i'll proceed so to transfer files from a remote linux server which has a port or which does not use the default ports then that's how we do it so we say scp and you say dash p the p should be uppercase and then you indicate the ports so mine the port is 30 22 before you bring the paths the, the address and the path to that file all right so it becomes bio info coach at now say 127.0.0.1 i bring my colon and then the rest is just the path let me get the path here the part to that file so there's the parts i'll just copy and paste and then dot slash that means that i'm transferring to my current working directory all right so that's how it is so let's execute this command all right so let's enter our password yeah so now we have it done all right so this is how we transfer files.